My name's Emma Obweze and I captained the Team England netball team to gold at the 2018 Gold Coast Commonwealth Games. I am a former board member of Commonwealth Games England. I currently sit on the board of Birmingham 2022 Organising Committee for the Commonwealth Games. I also chair the Athlete Committee in that as well and I'm also a trustee for Sports Aid. So the Birmingham Games are just around the corner and I wear a lot of different hats. In terms of Sports Aid, I had done a number of talks for them and sort of became an ambassador mentor for them. They put forward a bid for the Commonwealth Games England Team England's Futures programme and were successful. And I think the Team England's Futures uh, programme is great just to tie it in with our home games because a lot of times home games come and go and they're not necessarily maximised to the extent of the capability that they can be. In terms of long-term and legacy, those are the athletes who hopefully will be the athletes of the future going to further games. I think with athletes, a lot of time is spent on training and traveling, and there needs to be a focus on what's going to happen after sport. It's just a lot of things amalgamating together to look forward to the future, to celebrate lots of things. Everybody knows that athletes put in hours and hours of work in terms of their physical preparation, their mental preparation, buying equipment, and in terms of the education that you can surround them with, with regards to what it feels like at a games, how they can position themselves outside of the games, the pressures from media, how local support helps and impacts, how to gather funding. There's a whole plethora of things that you can educate them on so that they have that in their toolbox. And you hear a lot of athletes saying, oh, it was my first games or I just went for the experience. And actually, if we can, through the Team England Futures programme, sort of take away that in a sense. So it's not people saying, I'm going to my first games and they're just trying to absorb everything and take it all in. The Team England Futures programme basically almost enables sort of a bridge to happen. So athletes don't necessarily think, oh my gosh, it's my first games, it's overwhelming, it's multi-sport, there's lots going on, it's not just me and my sport. And so they've always had a bit of that experience and then learn from other people who've been in that position.